Welcome back to another video. So today is episode 20 of the Road to Glory. So pretty good that we've come uh, this far, I guess. 20 episodes is quite a lot for a series, I guess. Um, we're not stopping, so don't worry. Um, if you didn't check out last video, it was pretty good. Um, it was obviously episode 19. That'll be up there in the iCard. Um, yeah, go check it out. It was um load of content. So party bag SPC, inform uh, upgrade, 86 plus upgrade, and... Um, what was the other thing? The first thing we did in the video. Oh, Zhao Felix SBC. I literally forgot. Um, anyway, we're going to show you the team quickly. This is how it's looking at the moment. Uh, you might think it's a bit weird, but um, I explained it. Oh, we've got a concept missing. Um, I explained it in the last episode. Um, pretty much, I have gone and completed Zhao Felix. And then I packed an Inform Suarez. Used him, liked him so much. And bought a Ones to Watch and sold the pack pulled Inform. So 91k for this. For this ones to watch um atletico madrid are doing well in the league as well so and suarez actually what uh won uh atletico the game yesterday they won one nil um so you never know he could get an inform for that but i doubt it um especially just recently being in but he's he's really really good um i don't know why he's so good because like he's, he's not meta but um it's so fun playing with him i played four triple two with puskas right cam neymar left cam and suarez and felix up front and um yeah that is pretty much how how um, the club's going at the moment. Obviously, today we've got rivals and uh, foot champs rewards. We're looking to get Rashford or Carrasco. Um, Hakimi, spoiler alert, was in the... Um, uh, what's it called? Um, pack from... Uh, I can't think now. What's it called? Uh, party bag, that's the one. So um, we packed him twice, actually. I, um, I didn't put the second one on camera, but... Pretty much, I put Hakimi from the first party bag into the party bag SPC uh, for the second round and packed him again. So it was quite annoying, but um, that's what happened. And um, yeah, so this is the team at the moment. We're hoping to upgrade it with a Carrasco. I don't even know if Carrasco is an upgrade, but I, w I would want him having since having Xiao Felix in the club. The good thing is, I don't know why I've gone to objectives. Good thing is, if we do get two bad ones, which is likely we can do a foot champions upgrade so hopefully we'll do that this episode so yeah let's claim um division rivals oh, i do want to show you the um team of the week as well because you might not have seen it I, you probably have um we did get uh we should have rank one div one again we love that two mega packs two ultimate packs so yeah pretty hard to get there but we did it quite comfortably quite, i played quite well in um rivals this week which is very nice indeed so um yeah, that's that, and then hopefully today we pack a good red. So let's just quick quickly show you the team of the week if it wants to. Where is it? There it is. So Casemiro's in there. He looks okay. His centre back card is way better because he's a centre back, but um, he could be usable in some sort of team. Carrasco looks insane. Like I really like the look of that card. His balance could be better, but then apart from that, he looks really good. Langley might be good for. He could probably go in my team over Gomez and leave Allison off Ken, but I don't know if I would. It's probably not great. Um, Rashford is incredible. If he's the best one, obviously. And then um, Denier's all right, I guess. Cancelo's okay. And then uh, Martinez is good. And the rest are fodder, pretty much. So yeah, like I said, if we get two, we need two um, players for uh, what's it called the foot champions premium upgrade so if we get two bad ones then we can do it if we get one good and a bad we can't but at least we got a good then so stop the gold three like pretty much the last like four or five weeks now it's just not worth playing further than that so rashford carrasco come on okay first one is not <laughs> not a rashford or carrasco and then second one come on please Wow, well, that answers that. We're going to be doing a Foot Champions Premium Upgrade. Um, I guess we just take this guy. Wow. Yeah, might as well. It doesn't really matter, does it? So, um, yeah, really awful reds, which is expected because it just never is good. But, um, yeah, we want to go into the store now and open up our packs. And we'll do the Foot Champions Upgrade at the end. So, how many Megas? F four Megas. Two of them tradable, one of them not, and then 150k. I think it's pretty much the same pack opening as last week, except last week had a little bit more, actually. Um, but yeah, come on, Meg. Oh, walk out from the first Mega. It's not not any like special item. French striker, centre forward. That's decent, you know. First pack, Benzema, 89 rated. I thought he was 87. 
89 rated is kind of shocked me, but um, that is brilliant. He will be used somewhere down the line in an icon SVC probably or something for team of the year. I'm not sure what what's planned for team of the year, but um, yeah, very happy of that from the first pack as well. 75 to 80 player pick in there as well. Nothing really amazing out of these really. You can't get anything too good. Um, but no, insane start. We take that. We like that a lot. Um, there's not. I don't know if the 80. I don't think the 80 plus player picks are still out, so we're gonna have to discard those duplicate and tradables. But um, yeah, good start. If we can get back to back walkouts, it's quite a lot to ask. And I, could, I, I don't know. Can't see it happening. No. Okay, we get a board though. Come on, be uh, be Rashford. Actually, Rashford's informed now, so it can't be him. So it's Costich, 83 rated. Just all, all a bit of father. You know how I like my father, so um, yeah. We're, we'll take that two duplicates again. We literally just got him, didn't we? So he's going to be untradeable. All right, these two mega packs will be tradable then. These are from the foot champion rewards. So hopefully these can pack us something good that tradable wise. Not a walkout. It is a board. What sort of board? Uruguayan centre back Jimenez or Godin? Actually, that's better. 85 rated tradable. Um, He's about he's got to be about 12k I'm guessing, and and well, we did get at, oh wow he's up at about 13. Icon SPCs must be inflating these guys' price right now. So let's go for we're selling for 13. I don't know if he's going for more than that, but I'll take the 13k in red. Um, and then Jimenez is up at wow he's literally the 84s must be sky high right now. He's probably like. Wait, did we see? I'm sure I saw him for like a 6.5k bid. 6.4. It's probably a bit more than that. I'll send him for that. Should sell. 83s. They're kind of. They're about 2k. We'll keep the 83s then. And then final tradable mega pack before the big boy packs. The all player packs from the next three. Come on. Gives a walkout tradable. Yes, walkout. Come on. It's just a normal walkout. Belgium. Goalkeeper. Courtois. The two like highest rated um, flipping Real Madrid players, 89 rated as well, and he's going to sell for a ton. I know he will because he's tradable. That is brilliant. Anyone else in that pack as well? Go on, be a Varane. No, you want to? Nope. Okay. Don't matter. 45. Yes, go on. 50k. Um, I'm going to quickly... I'm going to send him up and I'll sell him later. Uh, Martinez, actually, I'll just check his price just in case. Oh, just sent him. I just list him before I quick sell that. Does that sell? No. All right. Into the rare player pack. We've already got two walkouts, which I don't really expect from the mega packs, which I'm quite happy about. Um, can we get top it off and back to back walkouts? Come on. Just a normal walkout this time again. Senegal, left wing. Yes! Sadio Mane, tradable. Get in. This has been insane. This is like one of my best awards ever. Mane tradable because he's uh, from the Foot Champions Awards. It's actually insane, guys. We've literally packed Courtois, Benzema and Sadio Mane. And Courtois and Mane of those have been uh, tradable packs. I'm so gassed at that. He's about, I'm sure he's like 200k still. That is very good indeed. No one else in there, but it does not matter. He is literally, ah, oh, okay. So he has gone down a bit, but he's still 170k. And we take that every day of the week. He's not going to go in the team. So he's just going to be he's going to be sold. We love that. We absolutely love that. And then we've got two ultimate packs. I don't know what to expect. Like, Do we, do I expect more walkouts because the pack looks good? Or do I just like run with what I've got? I can't. See. It isn't a walkout. No, I was going to say I can't see it being another walkout. I think that's an inform. French. Goalkeeper. Yeah, the 84. Oh, no, 82. The one we didn't pick from red picks. I'll take an inform, I guess. 82, he'll be using some sort of SBC where you need an inform. Not too shabby. 84 in there. A load of 83s. That is... It's decent. It's decent. We'll take it. Um, he can be sold. Lozano can be as well. Hopefully all of these are not uh, duplicate and tradables. There we go. Lovely. None of them to quick sell. And then final pack before we do the Foot Champions upgrade. Can we pack a big guy? An icon. You never know. We get a walkout. Just a normal walkout. Be Mbappe. Oh, Sama. 
yeah, that's um, that's kind of a stinky walkout. I can't lie. It's not the walkout you want to be getting. But 86 could mean there's a, Var a Varane in here. It used to mean there's a Rashford, but he's obviously an 88-rated walkout right now. So, um, yeah, come on. Okay, Glaski, two duplicates. So, I don't know who that could be, to be honest. Glaski in there, an 83. Not bad, I guess. Um, but making 100 and what? Actually, closer. Wow. Way over 200k because um, uh, Courtois and Mane will sell. That's that's absolutely insane. I'm so happy of that. Um, we've got two two sold items. Who have we sold? Probably Godin and that 84. Yeah, look at that, guys. That is that's incredible. Is Fakir worth anything? Uh, not really. Have we got him? No, he's still duplicate. Okay, um, let's sell Mane and Courtois. Might as well do it here. You can see me selling them then. Um, we're going to be sitting on an absolute load of coins. I don't, I don't know if there's anything you want me to do with the coins, guys. But um, one set... I oh, know that's a mil. Uh, 170k is what he's roughly going for. Okay, a little bit more. 174. We will sell ours for... Do you reckon he's, he's going to keep rising, though, isn't he? Surely by Friday he'll be up. I might I might keep money to, to sell for... Um, in a bit, we'll sell Courtois because he's just fodder. No one actually uses him. Like, like he doesn't go up and down because of his uh, usability. He's about. I know he's a bit less than that. He's going to be about fifty-four. Yeah, fifty-four k on the dot. We'll sell ours for fifty-three seven fifty to get him gone. Actually, you will probably just go for fifty-four. So, might as well just listen about fifty-four. Here we go. We'll get him gone. And then we'll do the foot champions upgrade 54k off he goes so we've made what about 20k there let's say because the other players as well and then 170 that's 190 plus 50 that is 240k plus our 250 now we'll be sitting on 490k once everything's sold and um so pretty much 500k and a bit of fodder from the other packs in the club as well like benzema glasky um yeah load of load of fodder in the club not enough for an icon yet, but we could spend some coins. If that's what you want, guys, you got you got to comment it. you got to let me know. But, um, yeah, we'll do the premium upgrade now. I think I've filled in most of the squad. Um, the two that I'm kind of like, they are good players. Rafinha, he's, he's decent. He's not he's not going to get in my team. He could be a super sub. And then Delaney is quite unique. He's a centre-back in form. But, I, like, we could just go and buy him if we wanted him. Oh, I'm David Marshall. He's a Cardiff legend, but I'm going to have to get rid of him because... I don't want to wait another week for this. Just want to get it done. Um, and Kante is obviously not going in. So let's do that. Do that. So I'm just choose the centre back quicker. And there he is. So get the 20 cam and the rating, whatever. Um, Tavernier is his old in form. So there's a better one than that. Marshall is obviously kind of legend. And then um, Rafinha and Delaney are okay. I don't know how. I only used Delaney once. Like, and. There's no point in keeping him. So, please, can we get someone someone usable at least? Like, I suppose we're not submitting anyone too bad. So, it's kind of just like, they're all low rated. And um, not that, like, SBC fodderish, I guess. No one over 84. So, um, hopefully, this player pick is good. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, God. Lozano. I'll take it. It's not. It's not great. Um, I don't know if I don't know if this is his second or first in form. It's, well, it's got to be his second. Eighty six rated, doesn't it? We might even have three in forms. I literally don't know. Leno not usable. Well, usable. Sorry, but and then Parejo not usable. Per, uh, Lozano will be a super sub. He does look really good. I'm not disappointed with that. I just it, it's the hope, isn't it? You, you probably think you can get someone better than that. So, yeah, it's not bad. Um, I just remembered I added up the things wrong. I said 240k. It will be up to 470 once Mane sells. Maybe a bit less after tax. I was adding in the gold in that's already sold. Gold in and Jimenez. But um, yeah, enough of that. You probably didn't notice anyway. It was just me thinking then. Um, who can we swap out? We've got two right mids from the Serie A now. Um, oh yeah, and also this Kubo's tradable. Um, they they yet to play their game. I don't know if they'll get through, but we might as well keep him. Kubo can probably get... Uh, sent to the transfer list uh, actually because he's not that good um, and will be sold eventually so yeah 
Let's get in our new red Lozano, who, who I am happy about. He's going to be a good super sub, definitely, because like, look at his stats there. Actually quite insane. Um, four star skill moves is good. High low is good. As a super sub, he'll be just straight up the pitch, and the, he's absolutely rapid as well. So, yeah, we'll take that. He'll be good. Good fun to bring off the bench in a foot champs game or whatever. So, yeah, if you enjoyed the video, please hit a thumbs up and subscribe already. Peace.